this side, please. <laughs> Thanks. As I said to Terry when he walked into the door, uh, here we go again. Here we go again. But it's amazing that uh, not only do we get one piece done, we are shooting another feature film here in Kingston. This is probably one of the most ambitious things that has been done. We're doing Dracula. We're doing Bram Stoker's Dracula. We're doing a faithful adaptation of the book. We're shooting at Fort Henry. We're shooting on some fantastic old locations. We are going to create something that is special. Um, and it's gonna knock uh, it's gonna knock people's socks off because we did it thanks to the generosity of people like yourselves. Perhaps Bowling. today you will remember this. It's addressed to me. The man who sent you this, he, he is not known to us. I remember so very little since I left England. My God, what is it that I have willed myself to forget? Nothing approaches from the distance. Turning to vice is not the solution to help young Lucy. How is she? Arrested. She has lost a notable quantity of blood. Welcome to my home, Mr. Park. It was quite a trek from Orwell Pass. The fog is he is heavy, and I am sure I heard a sound of all That man Jonathan went to see, a count, had suggested that Jonathan might spend a little time at the castle to help him with the language. John Seward, uh, call me Jack. Truth be told, I am unsettled. How long has she been ill? Oh, several weeks. She had lost an exceptional amount of blood. I don't want to die. I wish to live forever. The mist thickens and the sound of walls grows louder and fiercer. Tell that to the sea. She'll have none of that. Mr. Swales, isn't it? Aye, still me. Just a little more weathered each day. You may destroy me. But this will be your last night on this earth. <laughs> you are not the first man to try to challenge me, Professor. So many have tried, and they are all dead now. And yet I still exist. Why did you come here? To feed, to survive. Such is the very basic instinct of my kind, of your kind, Van Helsing. I <laughs> am terrified of spiders. Here's a little anecdote before we begin. So I went on the ghost tour with Bill a few weeks ago uh, at Fort Henry. And uh, there's one part, if anybody's been to Fort Frider on the ghost tour, you go down this, these stairs into a tunnel and there's a large antechamber at the end of it, which is where we're shooting the interior for the castle scenes. And uh, just as we're about to go down, I look and there's this huge spider, about yay big. Was, the spider was this big. It was this big. <laughs> and it was sitting in this web above the door. And this was, this, was, um, this was early June, and we're shooting in late August, okay, and September. So I look at this and I said, wow. I'm, I'm not going to go down there. Let the group go. I used to work for the tour anyway. Let the group go down and I'll wait up here. So they came back up and I, I quietly said to the guy, I said, so, uh, <clears throat> is there a spider problem down there right now? And she said, oh, no, no, we only have those guys down there now. <coughs> you mean only? She said, late August, early September, we don't usually bring the groups down because that's when we get the big ones. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Anyway, so, anyway, so. So I died a little that night, and Bill turned to me and he said, you know what, that's worth my money. Everybody. <laughs> <laughs> to make a film like this, if you read the script, first of all, we had a great script. I wrote the script, Bill went back in, he revised the script, he added a couple of new subplots. It was a collaboration, but I really think that what we have is a great adaptation of Dracula. So we have the script, right? The script doesn't call for any major special effects or anything along those lines. What it requires is it requires performance. It's character-driven, it's dialogue-driven. So we have a great script. We have an amazing cast. Okay? So when you have those two elements, the only, the only area in which, you can, um, in which we could falter is with locale. But we have such an incredible locale in Fort Henry. We have these wonderful Victorian interiors. We have per perfect uh, antechambers for the castle. So we have all three of the elements that we need sitting in this pot um, to do something special. And you know what? We're going to do it. So not only are we going to make a good Dracula movie, we're going to make a great Dracula movie. And I truly believe this is going to be something that a lot of people um, are going to want to and are going to see internationally. So, okay? so this is exciting. Welcome. <laughs>